coming off of a loss to St. Joe's by 14. When they also lost to Penn by four, they were 0-3 in the Big Five Classic, meaning they finished sixth in a tournament called the Big Five, which is just wild <laughs> to think about when you're Villanova. In the Big Five, that doesn't happen. So the, the big issue is they, they don't know how to run zone offense. They have no clue. I don't know why anybody would do anything other than play zone against them at this point. And I think we are at a situation where it's like you got to sit here and say, like, is – is, is Kyle Neptune the right guy? Like he's, he, I want it to work for him. I like Kyle. I, I would say this. More than is Kyle Neptune the right guy, like you can't win without a point guard. You cannot win without a point guard. You know, you had Chris Archie Diacono last year who was a backup, and you have Mark Armstrong this year who's a backup. You can't win. Like you're seeing that incons- – they, they've won it. I mean, they were great in the Bahamas, so they've proven like they can, but it's that inconsistency. I, look, I think it's they have no clue what to do against the zone. And I don't know, if the, is that a point guard issue? It helps to is have a point a guard, issue? doesn't it? Is that a passing issue? Is that a everything issue? Fake a pass to make a pass versus the zone. You know, we got to get the, up 55 ship points, the zone. You put up 55 points against Drexel. Like, look, I love you, yeah. Zach. I, Zach Spiker, great coach. The Drexel, you put up 55 points against them. Yeah. In I, the fifth place game of the Big Five Classic. And again, you've lost to Penn, St. Joe's, and now Drexel. Like, Jay Wright used to own this this. Like, he never lost a big five game. This dude has lost three of them already this year. That is not good. It's it's not great. And I think Chris Mack had the best line the other night about Villanova. I think he called him Jekyll and Hyde. Yeah. Is that what he said? Yeah. Jekyll and Hyde That's trying to figure been. them out, coming out of the Bahamas. You know, it, 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 Villanova's – we got to move past it because Coach Wright's not there anymore. Kyle Neptune's there. He's the coach. But they were always this – Offense and this just executing machine, no matter what, right? Like I bet, even I bet the game they, winner. I, hey, I yeah, bet if they had Colin Gillespie, like just, they knew what to do. Mm-hmm. They knew where to be. They knew where to go. And I think it's too much to put all on a third-year head coach taking over for. If he had Colin Gillespie, he'd be Hall fine. Famer. Or Jalen Brunson, or Ryan know. Archie Diakon. I don't. I don't oh, know. Oh come though. on! I don't Are you out of your mind? I think it would. Well, that look, would make all the difference in the world. Look, yes. they wouldn't have lost any of those three. Maybe but, one of them. If you add. A guy like Jalen Brunson, any of those, national any of those guys, year, any of the three, national champion, and probably the most accomplished college basketball player in the last ten years. Yes, that's going to make you better. It's Jalen fucking no, Brunson. I'm, I'm what are we talking I'm about here? Gillespie, what are we talking I'm about here? Like, oh, you know what? If we put Michael Jordan back on the Bulls in his prime, I think that they would be better. You, what do you think? Would that help? <laughs> would that help? It's the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard you say. He of course, he, he doesn't listen very well. Of course, it's going to be better. He doesn't, than he doesn't Jaylen listen, Brunson. McCall. You're pointing more towards coaching you're pointing more towards players yes you're yes. thinking it's more personnel based 100 percent. you're thinking it's coaching base no i think it's also personnel based but i just think it's ridiculous to say like yeah if they had jalen Brunson, of course they'd be better if they had jalen i said there three isn't guys. a single team said, in the history of college basketball they if, wouldn't be better if i'm gonna without, give, I'm gonna give him, i'm gonna give him the kelsey eyes you know that i'm gonna give him the kelsey eyes don't talk to me 